Hey guys, welcome back to our virtual classes here at Warrior Athletics United. Let's go ahead and start today with some stretches.
if you'd like to use drills from the past videos, feel free to do that. So let's get started. All right, so we're gonna do the exact same thing as last week. We're just gonna add in some new small little drills. But first we're gonna start with our lines that's taped on the ground using any kind of painter's tape, electrical tape, masking tape, no duct tape, okay? So Jennifer's gonna do backwards bear crawls this first time around. So make sure our hands and our feet are on either side of the line. There we go. Keeping our bottom up in the air. Awesome. All right, next thing we're gonna do is those four roll drills. Okay, so she's gonna lay with her toes against the wall and have her knees really tight and back and high five that line on the wall. If you haven't watched, you can watch our previous video, um, week one video. You can go ahead and redo this drill. And just fast forward through those stretches if you need to. All right, so we're gonna be doing frog jumps again. Making sure that our bottom is down, we're gonna be doing 10. So we're gonna start with our hands on the ground, touching, just barely touching, three to the sky, one, and touch the ground. Then up and touch the ground. Parents, that's three. Parents, make sure that our bottoms are not up like this. When we're in our tumble class, sometimes our uh, little like to cheat, or even our older kids. All right, so keeping our bottoms down. Six, seven, eight, Nine and ten. All right. This drill is very similar to the drill we did last week, but with one little change. All right, we're gonna start in our lunge, and this time instead of going straight to the wall, we're going to turn our hands like this. Sideways. Make sure you're squeezing your core when you're doing that. Makes it nice and tight. So for the next drill, we'll be doing hand walks. It's very similar to what we do here at the gym, but instead of using a mat, we're gonna be using our couch, okay? So our toes are going to go on the couch. Parents, make sure it's not our knees, it's just our toes, and our hands are on the floor. Flat. Yes, flat. Okay, we're gonna simply go to walking Alright. As we've done in previous videos, we're gonna be doing our puddle kicks. Alright. Hands by our ears. Day one. And it's open. And keep up. One. Two. Three. And five. Make sure we're only doing five this time instead of ten. We're going to be adding another drill today. It is going to be our lemon squeezes. We've done these here at the gym. Um, so what we're going to do is start in the hollow body. Coach Jennifer's heels are going to be up about six inches and our arms are going to be back. And we're going to do this five times. Notice that her feet are not touching the floor. It is all right if sometimes they do touch a little bit. Five. Good job, Coach Jennifer. Here we go with our handstands. Remember that we want a nice clear wall before we get started with these. Our hands are gonna go on the floor, our arms are gonna be glued to our ears, and we're gonna walk our toes up. Walking our hands in if we can, counting to 10, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Make sure that just our toes are on the wall too. This is our last new drill. Coach Jennifer is gonna demonstrate for us. Our feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. Our body is gonna be a foot and a half away, about a foot and a half away from the wall, however far away you're comfortable with. Our arms are gonna start by our ears, and our hands are gonna go to the wall, and a standing back bend, and then come back up. We're gonna do this five times. Two, three, squeeze that core nice and tight. Four, and one more time, Christian. Five. The first couple times, have your parents supervise just in case. If you want, you can take a water break right now, but we're gonna go ahead and get started on this circuit. Kind of go with the flow and keep going.
before we do this, make sure you're taking a sip of water. It's very important to stay hydrated. Instead of doing bear crawls this time around, we're gonna be doing crab walks instead. All right, let's go.
for joining us for another virtual beginner class, and we hope you'll join us again next week. Are you ready to clap it up, Coach Kate? Oh. Clap it up. Warriors on three. One, two, three, warriors!